Okay, guys. So, as I said, I'm just going to report this plant over here into <laughs> this plant into this bigger pot because it's been growing and I want it to grow even more. I don't know how much growth we're going to get from this plant, but I got myself some cactus soil mix. Um, I would have bought normal soil and added some fun stuff, but I, I was just lazy. I have normal soil. I could have just bought like perlite and other things, but yeah, as I said, I was lazy to do that. So I bought cactus soil, which I know is pretty good for most plants. At least I use it for almost all house plants, unless I have a way of mixing everything. So that's what we're going to do today. I'm going to have to move this plant from here into here and it's going to be interesting because she has been living in here the whole time there she is okay let's try that massage 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 everything all right not looking bad i might <laughs> It could go back into the same pot, actually. Not looking bad. So I'm going to change the soil. Let me fluff fluff the soil and see what happens. Let's see what happens now. Uh oh, everything is getting loose. We might put her back in the same pot that she was in because it looks like she doesn't need to move currently, at least. The roots are not bounded. So I don't think we need to move her. So right now I'm just fluffing the soil so that we remove it from this because yeah, we need new soil. From the look of things, we might be putting, putting her back. And nothing brings me joy <laughs> than putting the plant where it was. That means I don't have to change many things around the house. I love that. And this plant is misbehaving, so I might have to remove all the support and redo that. So let's actually do that. Let's do that now. But how are you? How have you been? Let me know in the comment section how you are, how your summer has been. I will make a video of my summer, of what I did what's been going on and where I am, of course, still in the same house with my same babies. But, you know, life happens. Things happen too. So just let me know in the comment section how you're feeling, what's, what has been going on and all that. But yeah, I'm trying, I'm thriving. You know, life things happening, uh, but just, keeping on that's what's going on but yeah plants bring joy to my life so this really helps it does it does help but yeah how is your weekend today is sunday tomorrow is work day <sighs> going back to work to end the money why do we have to end it why can't we just get it we can't i guess we can't just get it for free we always have to end it but yeah but the weather has been so good uh, this weekend it's supposed to be in the 90s during the week but the weekend has been good we even got 50s and 60s throughout the weekend I'm going to go for a run after this so that'll be fun as well that will just conclude the weekend for me it will end on a good note yeah okay this is where we are just trying to remove all the little things that i used to attach this plant these these poles used to be for a shoe rack that is no longer in use 
so now i got them <laughs> i get to use them as my plant as my for my plants so that's what we're doing now but yeah what's up guys what's this been going on online i don't even know i don't even know much except for sitting and studying i'm studying for a little course a little certification i'm doing and when i'm not doing that i'm playing the office or a random movie uh just doing all that just to pass time and today i literally spent the day what did i do today i cooked i ate took a nap watched vampire diaries <laughs> i don't know how many times i've watched that show but i was just people have been talking about it a lot online uh at least my algorithm has been showing me just that side of the internet so i gave in and told myself let me just go back and watch the salvators let me go watch the brothers <laughs> and see what they have to say <laughs> So, yeah, that's what I've been doing. Just watching them. Uh, uh. <laughs> yeah. And Bunny the Witch, our favorite. No one can say otherwise. They did dirty. They played us dirty. Bunny could have been something in that show. Something even more. They didn't allow us to win, huh? They didn't. But it was so good, though. That was a good show. We grew up together with those people so oh my god i don't know if you'll be able to see this because the sun is going down but right now i'm looking at a sack a sack that is used to propagate the plants i'm looking at it right now and i'm removing it it had never been removed isn't that amazing the good thing is the plant grew outside the sack as well but i'm seeing that there were two sacks maybe I'm removing the other part there was possibly two that were used for this plant okay we have removed all the soil now what I'm going to do is put back so this is what it looks like I don't want to break the plant so this is what it looks like and let's see if the same pot will work or we still need to in use a bigger one actually we're putting it back in we are using the same one um let me do that oh my god i didn't know that this plant does not grow too many roots at least too big or too bounded together roots so this is interesting okay let's do this come here come here okay this is what we're dealing with put her in here put some water and then put back the roots and then we cover it up we cover it up with this new soil. I hope this will help this plant grow even better without suffering too much. We, I have, I have a problem in this house. I have, uh, I have a, I have some pests that are coming from my plant. Is that black? what do you call them the one that are like very tiny black little spots looking can't remember the name yeah those ones they are on plant leaves so i've been cleaning them at least this one is not is not yet it was a tag last year and i cleaned it and used neem oil used soapy water all the things so now i am using the same things on all the plants that are currently suffering and i hope by the end of summer as winter comes because do you know what in winter i don't really care to take care of the plants they're just growing i just water them and move on in winter when they're just stagnant i have enough time to look at every plant and care for it so this pests 
very soon they'll be gone. I'm going to deal with them. We're going to deal with them. So what have I done to care for this plant? Right? If, if you're caring for your plant, you need to let people know what you're doing for it to continue growing. This plant has been growing so well, and I didn't even know that it was great. Oh, I broke a leaf. I'm sorry. It was, it, it's been growing so well, and I didn't even know that it has been growing so well until, um, until spring came and I decided to rearrange all my plants. That's when I was like, oh my God, this plant has been growing throughout winter without telling me. <laughs> it did not warn me in advance that it's, it's going to be one of those plants that just grows. So yeah, it's been growing so well and I've been so proud of it. <laughs> I'm like a mom, right? Like I'm so proud of my child. Yeah, I've been so proud of it. What have I done to help it with its growth? I have just provided. I think I put, I gave it a fertilizer twice this year. And after that, I, I just let it be and set it next to my east facing window, which is the window you're seeing in my back right now. Hope this mic is still working. I'm sorry if I blow into into your ears, but uh, I just put it there and keep it there and water only when the soil is dry. How do I know the soil is dry? I sometimes don't, but most times I do. I will let the plant sit without being watered for like a few weeks, especially in winter. It usually takes a few weeks before the plant starts complaining if it's thirsty so because of that oh interesting maybe we need a bigger pole should i use a so i bought very tall <laughs> this is too tall yeah that's too tall i'll use these later i'll use them later since i cut back the plant we don't need them instantly as i as i previously intended so yeah so i um I just keep it, I just give it these poles to hold it still so that the plant doesn't, um, so that the plant doesn't break because, you know, they want to grow tall. They want to keep going. And I'm like, where are you going? You can stay young. I don't mind. I love my little tiny plants, but some wants to grow and leave me behind and leave this house. I don't know where they are trying to go. So what I'm going to do is I'll put these poles on each one and then I'll connect the poles later. So now the interesting part is I have more that are also tall. So we'll need at least one of these, right? That's what we're going to do now. We'll pull one of the tall ones. I'm not sure I'll break it. I don't think I will. I will just keep it tall because this plant grows tall so bad. <laughs> this is going to be so ridiculous. Like who has such a tall looking anchor, whatever we are trying to call this. Why do I have it so tall? Oh, get in there. There we go. You see that? You see that all of them are going to be connected we'll connect them very soon so it's all good it's all good so now i will tie her over here oh my god this is interesting please don't break please do not break on me mm. i'm like how do in nature obviously they attach to trees and they just go and it's so funny that most of these plants that we keep in our homes, they are invasive in nature. They are out here suffocating our trees, but we are out here enjoying them when they are not hooked to a tree in the house. Yeah. On other house plants updates, updates, I killed my mango, my orange bonsai tree that I decided to start caring for and put outside because I thought the weather was 
nice outside. I killed it, not intentionally, but it died. I was so pissed off. I was like, what do you want me to do now? I no longer have a bonsai. My friend gave me a bonsai plant to care for because she was, it was losing leaves. It survived for a while. Now it doesn't have any leaves. <laughs> so that's like crazy to me. I'm like, why are you hating on me, Miss Bonsai plant? Oh, the bonsai trees don't like me. Um, I don't know what to do to get them to continue growing in my space. But I've tried to care for them a little. I've tried. Just hasn't worked. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. For now, let me care for the ones that are enjoying my space as well. In that case, this baby over here, she's been good. She's not growing like huge leaves or anything, but she has behaved herself. Because even the Monstera Peru, when she had bugs, she was acting up a little. But this one, nope. She behaved throughout. So we are rewarding her by giving her better soil so that she continued growing taller like her mama, me. And let's see how that goes. Oh, look at this. So, this is about to be interesting. We're about to use the same pole on two plants. Isn't that interesting? Okay, this is about to be cool. Cool, cool, cool. Oh my god. There we go. Shoot, the plant is falling. Uh-oh. We need more soil in here, I guess. We possibly do. Everything is like, what are we doing? So I'm going to put this pole maybe over here in front so that we have more anchoring. And then... I will tie all the poles together. I didn't know that this was going to be this this much work. I didn't know that. Yeah, so what else did I want to say to you guys? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, my God. I am going to record a video of a plants update. To just show you guys where we are with all the plants and see if some are behaving or not just in case as we know there's always one or two that are misbehaving yo so you see this is my plant that is always grow oh my god i just broke the leaf i'm sorry i didn't mean to Oh, I'm sorry, my baby. I'm sorry, my baby. Okay. Uh, all right. <laughs> she will stress me out because I don't know what to do with her. She's looking like she might need to be helped, anchored. Okay, let's do this. Let me anchor her a little and then look. Actually, hold on, hold on. Let me anchor her after I get the other piece to, to support. Oh, my God, my legs. Oh, you know, we are aging, man. Oh, 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 oh. Sitting down is so hard and painful. It is so painful. Oh. Right now, I'm looking for my... Um, wait, where is it? I'm looking for the, for the, uh, how do you call it? For the cord to use. Huh. Interesting. I can't find it. But do you know what I have? I have some of these pegs 
that I can use. Let's see if they work. If they work, I'll just use them instead and not try to use anything else. So let's try to peg you. I am going in and pegging her to the to one of the poles. Looks like it's working. Okay, and then I'll come in here and take her and peg her the trunk and the pole. Perfect. All right, that worked. Okay, that worked. So now, this is interesting. Oh, interesting. Now I can use the last piece that I had to tie, to tie this. But yeah, I didn't have much today to talk about. I just hope you are doing good. I just wanted to come in, check in, and see where you are, uh, how you are doing, and all that. I hope this video is just a little hello that, br that brings you calmness to your day as you watch me doing whatever I'm doing here. <laughs> We're done, we're done. It's not yet fully anchored, but I promise when the soil is dry or now more compact, after a little while, when the roots have given in to their new home, the plant will be fine. It will not be looking like it's falling. For now, it'll be like this. But I think we're good. I think we are done. I will stand up and put her back to her home. I'm just happy that she stayed in the same home. That is so good to me. I don't have to redo this, looking for another pot, at least the decorative pot. I don't have to do that this year. I'll deal with that problem next year. Oh my God, there we go, uh-oh. Uh oh, I'm trying to lift it up. Why? Because there's water in the pot. See? All right. This is it. <laughs> I hope this will be our our thumbnail. Where I hope I'm there too. <laughs> yeah, this should work. If it doesn't, I don't know. We'll figure it out. Okay, thank you. Bye. I hope you find something that brings you joy today. Just a little bit of a smile to your face. Just something, right? I was looking just in case I was flushing someone. But yeah, no. All right, I'll talk to you very soon. Bye. Okay, we need the water to drip and be done be done please oh this is about to be interesting oh this is too tall Whoop. Oh, there we go. Maybe we should go together. Let's go. Uh-oh. There we go. Please don't fall. <laughs> this plant is about to show me flames. It's about to show me who is boss, I guess. There we go. This is how it looks. We need to figure out what to do with how it's top heavy right now. But look at it. Isn't she pretty? 
she is pretty right okay please stay like this amen <laughs> amen look at her pretty pretty looking so this is a home of course i always change my space a little every time so this is where she is right there and the sun comes in and fills out the whole space and they enjoy the morning sun and then just enjoy the brightness throughout the day i moved back plants over here my monstera is doing good i did the propagation of the same plant yesterday last night so it's over there in the dark for now i'm going to move her but this was just for me to, to look at her um but yeah it gets dark at night during summer at least during fall and winter time during summertime it's good the brightness doesn't end but now yeah the signs of winter are here all right this is it guys with this i say bye bye i already said bye so this should not be something new <laughs> oh it shouldn't come at a surprise but yeah anyway that's all guys it's a long video <laughs> i don't know why i'm still recording i should just go right okay bye